But a strong church will be a, a church that reaches out, a missions-minded church. A church that isn't afraid to lose someone and, and uh, isn't a, afraid to lose someone to the Lord's work. And that actually, that wants that. In fact, I think that's a, probably one of the greatest things that can happen in a local church is when someone is trained up in that local church and then God reaches into that place and finds that faithful person and calls them to something else and brings them out away from the rest of their friends and the congregation says, yep, you're doing good there, you did great there, but I got something else for you. And of course, Jesus Christ himself said, pray ye the Lord of the harvest that he would send forth laborers into his harvest. And that'd be a great thing if the Lord would reach into this place and take one of you or take one of our kids and say, yeah, that's great there and that church has been great and it's a wonderful church, but I've got something for you someplace else. And that, that's a, that is a mark of a, strong, of a strong church. And that may mean that it might be your kid, or it might be my kid, or it might be our, our grand, your grandkids. It might, be, it might be you. And you ought to be willing to do that. And you ought to be willing if the Lord would have that for you.